Many athletes have been speaking out about social reform since the death of Mr. George Floyd. And some of them are putting their careers on hold to fight for change. Pat Gallen talks with a local athlete who's stepping off the court for social reform. Cloud busting to the rim. It takes a lot to become a champion, but it takes even more to walk away on top. Delco native, former St. Joe's star, and WNBA champion Natasha Cloud is doing just that in her prime. Following the Washington Mystics title last year, Cloud is stepping away this season for two reasons. I feel that I'm being called for social reform um, and using the platform that I have, using the voice that I have and the momentum and leverage that I have at this very moment. And the second main reason is uh, health and safety. Um, you know, it, this is a time where uh, COVID is such a deadly virus. It's very unknown. It's very unknown what long-term effects it could potentially have on us. How much more difficult does it make it knowing that you and the Mystics are coming off a title? In the last three, four weeks, I haven't been able to think about basketball. Um, I have had no motivation to play basketball. People are like, well, you should just play. You know, when I take that uniform off, I am a black female. When I enter into the real world, I'm a black female. I don't get to take my color off. After a season which saw her named a second team all defensive player, Cloud is pressing pause on her career at a pivotal moment. But she says while it was difficult, it was the right move because she is seeing change. We have seen massive protests across the country and really across the globe in the wake of the death of George Floyd and now in support of Black Lives Matter. Do you think that we are headed in the right direction? I'm hopeful. I'm extremely, extremely hopeful. I've been at different protests, whether it's been in Philly, whether it's been in DC, and it's such a beautiful and powerful thing to see um, people from all walks of life, uh, different races, different backgrounds, different religions, uh, coming together for, uh, for a greater cause. Pat Gallen, CBS3 Eyewitness Sports.